recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, over four years ago, Obamacare was signed into law and sold to the American people on numerous false promises. Americans were promised that premiums for a typical family would go down. The President told Americans that if you like your health care plan, you can keep it. And if you like your doctor, you can keep your doctor. However, that was not true. And now many Americans are grappling with a very different reality. As a result of Obamacare, millions of Americans have seen their health care plans canceled. Families are finding that they may not get to keep the doctor that they like. And premiums in the individual market are increasing by 41 percent in the average state. Mr. Speaker, the American people deserve better. Instead of putting the federal government in the driver's seat of our nation's health care decisions, we need solutions that will protect the doctor-patient relationship, foster economic growth, and empower patients by giving them the choice and control. Today, I'm pleased to stand in support of H.R. 596, legislation that would not only repeal Obamacare, but would instruct the House to come forward with a patient-centered free market alternative. Mr. Speaker, I yield back the balance of my time. Gentleman from Michigan.